we talk about being seen and heard, right? Yep. So even if you don't have friends in the hospital, people get to know you become, you know, affiliated with other colleagues, fine. What we used to do is we all went on our own. I got to meet you, met me. We never knew each other before then. But many of us had like a pact. We're like, okay, I'm in PEDS, you're an internal, you're an OB. Every time we see each other in the hospital, let's pull over, let's just stop a few minutes, say hi. And then you tell me a case that you saw today. I'll tell you a case that I saw today. So even though I was internal medicine, I ended up seeing my friends in PEDS and other rotations and they told me an awesome case. And next thing you know, they said, hey, watch out for this. Hey, you should go with this physician. You see what happens? The more you're there, the more you build relationships and friendships. And then at that point, you look out for each other. So not only did I, was I doing multiple cases throughout the week in multiple specialties, but I had a heads up of which physician to go to, which to stay, not stay away from, but steer clear because they weren't really teaching you. And all because of connecting and being there all the time and being reliable because I was a team lead in internal medicine. So they respected me because they knew I was always on my word. I was always responsible there early, leaving late. And they knew they, knew they could depend on me. That's what it was. So.